Now, one of the most common questions I come across Instagram messages or YouTube videos is that how do I carry my drone inside an Indian airport and come back safely? Now, that's when I decided that I have to make a vlog for those people to understand how to carry the drone inside an Indian airport without having to compromise on the Indian drone regulations. With that being said, Wanakam, Sasriya Kala, Assalamualaikum, welcome back to the channel. Let's dive straight to the video. Now, before I begin, let me clear a myth that is revolving around the drone laws in India. So, owning a drone that has got its unique identification number is not illegal in India. That's right. So, all you drone pilots who have got their drone registered before 31st January 2020 and got their unique identification number, you guys can carry your drone inside and outside an Indian airport and do not have to worry about anything. And also, I will share an incident where my drone was confiscated at Chennai airport and how I got it back. So stay tuned and watch till the end. Now coming to the point on how to carry a drone inside an Indian airport without having any problems. Now I have this massive DJI Phantom 4 which gives me crazy dope sick drone shots. But at the same time, it's a pain in the wrong side when it comes to carrying it around with its huge size and also its pool-like attention-seeking capability. So how do I carry this massive thing without having any problems? It's very simple. I carry my drone inside a drone bag which comprises of the drone, remote, propellers and essential cables. Now, either I carry my drone with me in hand luggage or sometimes loaded as check-in baggage depending on the kind of airlines I'm flying with or the number of luggages I'm dealing with at that point of time. Sometimes I just simply put the drone bag inside another suitcase and load it as check-in baggage like I did in my Andaman series. Now whenever I do that, I request the airport authorities to mark that bag as fragile and I ensure I remove the drone batteries and carry it with me in the hand luggage. I repeat, do not keep the batteries inside the drone bag in case you decide to load the drone in check-in baggage. That's it. That's all there is to carrying your drone safely as per the rules and regulations of an Indian airport. Yes, as easy as it could be. Now let's get to the story where my drone got confiscated at Chennai airport. This will also reinstate the fact that carrying a drone is actually not illegal in India. So on my way back from Andamans to Mumbai, I had a connecting flight through Chennai. Now the check-in bag that had my drone got cleared in Andaman airport. However, it got stuck at Chennai airport during an inline scan for a very simple reason. I actually forgot to remove the batteries from the drone bag and carry it in my hand luggage. I repeat, do not keep the batteries inside the drone bag. The Chennai airport manager had actually tried calling me over the phone so that I could go to the scan department and fix the problem by removing the batteries. However, since my battery was low, I had put my phone on airplane mode. On arriving at Mumbai airport, I connected with the airline authorities when I saw a bag missing and they in turn connected me with the Chennai airport manager and he gave me three options to get my drone back. Option one was to give them permission to open my bag so they could remove the drone batteries and throw it off and send the drone by the next flight to Mumbai. Now I could have done that, but in there was batteries worth 40,000 Indian rupees. So that's a big no for me. Option two was for me to reach Chennai personally and collect the bag so that I could remove the batteries and carry it in hand luggage and then put the drone in check-in or hand luggage however I choose. And finally, option three, where I have to write an email stating that someone on my behalf would come to the airport and collect the bag. Luckily for me, one of my uncles stays near the airport and he helped me out to collect the bag from the airport and handed it over to my dad who was near Chennai at that point of time. So a big shout out to my uncle and my dad without whom this could have been possible. So moral of the story being, there is nothing illegal in carrying a drone as such and that is why the airport authorities didn't confiscate my drone. Their only problem was the batteries that was left in the check-in baggage instead of carrying it in the hand luggage. 
So just ensure you follow the process right and you won't face any issues at all. And I believe this video has helped to resolve all of your myths and doubts and queries that you had in carrying a drone to the Indian airport. Please let me know in the comment section if you have any further questions or yahan tak video dekh rahe ho to like ka button do banta hai and do subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet i'll see you again with yet another amazing story until then you know what to do keep exploring keep learning cause that's a way to grow my lovely friends love and peace out